there's something that has been bothering me lately, guys. And, well, not really bothering me. I have my reasons to believe why this is the case. And you know what that is? You know, and you and Asta aren't gonna win against the battle against Lucius. Lucius might take the W. And that's crazy to believe. As of prior to this, prior to Asta's training and his confidence coming back, I remember one specific panel where Asta stated that he will never lose again. And when I looked at this panel, guys, you see the determination in his eyes, you see the frustration, you see the confidence brimming. And I think to myself that, nah, some, this is wrong. You tell us that you're never going to lose again with that much confidence. And the writer tells us this. And I can't help but think there's a side of me that believes that Asa's going to take an L. A second L from Lucius. This would be his second L. His first L was emotional damage that you know that Lucius did to him when he transformed the sister Lily into, you know, a paladin and struck him down and left him for dead, right? That, and that crushed him, that crushed his soul. And his confidence is back up. His power is increased with the new implications of Zetin and he's ready. And he's confident and he really does believe that he will take down Lucius. And spoiler alert, Asta, Lucius is just as confident as you are in his own abilities. And that's scary to think about as a huge mastermind with the capability of time magic and the ability to see into the future. And yes, I'm aware he cannot see a future that you know, Asta has affected, right? And by the looks of it, he's aware of that. And he might take precautions, he might have a plan up his sleeve to counter just that. And I do believe he has something planned for Asta. For example, many of us have been theorizing about a potential ritual that he has set up for Asta. Some where he might try a devil binding ritual on Asta to steal Liebe from him. Um, leaving, you know, Asta powerless, right? He might even turn Yuno into a paladin, making one of the strongest weapons possible to go up against Asta, right? To take him down, to take the nuisance out, right? Anything's possible, but I do believe you, Lucius, isn't gonna take the L this Judgment Day arc. He said it himself. This is the first steps to the Judgment Day arc, right? It's the first steps into true world peace. This, what he has going on. In the clover kingdom is just the beginning right there's so many other things taking place there's different supreme devils yet known there's a dramalic who might be pulling strings behind the scenes there are more paladins that we are probably yet to see there are more lucius's has yet to even cast a spell that we know of right he has just been cast in power not spells right and we are yet to see any abilities that you know could extract a soul or implant well we've seen where he had implanted souls but we haven't seen where he had extracted souls or any other of his soul magic capabilities and that that's scary to think about that we know very of his magical abilities right and i highly believe that lucy's confidence is on par with Asa's confidence and i do believe that lucy's has something planned for Asta, and i don't believe that this is it for Lucius Sagratus. I don't believe that long-awaited battle against Lucius versus Asta and Yuno. That battle might not end with Yuno and Asta being the victor. That might end with them taking a mass fell that will crush their spirits and send them down the loop of revenge once again. Something's... There's a threatening aura that's happening in this arc. And I have my reason to believe this, guys. I just explained to you guys why I do believe that Lucius is menacing aura that us Tabada has set up. He's giving Aizen vibes, right? He's from the very beginning we met him, he gives off Aizen vibe. So I believe that Asta and Yuno are gonna take an L. But hey, I don't be surprised if they win. I'm here for it if they win. And if the fight is well executed, right? If it's well executed and Lucy's defeat is well executed and they take the win and the arc ends and Black Clover swiftly comes to an end, I'm okay. But I do believe there's a side of me and I trust my gut at times that Asta and Yuno are going to take an L and it's going to crush their spirits 
but are gonna come back for vengeance and that's where things are gonna get spicy and yeah that's my take guys i just had this on my chest for a while and i'm sure you guys can agree too that that is aura that tabata has created with the fight between the long-awaited fight for Asta, you know, and Lucius. So, without further ado, guys, let me know in the comments down below what you feel about this battle upcoming. Um, I know it's a long way, guys. December it feels like such a long way, but the year has been moving progressively fast, and I like that. But so, by look around, it's December. So, just find something else, indulge in, work on yourselves, um, reminisce about the good times you had with Black Clover. Talk about it here with me, guys, and we wait till Black Clover returns. And with a banger chapter, I'm sure Tabata has one good one planned for us. So, third of you guys, check out my other videos, shorts that I've dropped, and all that sort. Without further ado, subscribe for more, leave a like on this video. See you guys in another one. Peace.